Oh, the thunderstorm is still going on. Okay, we have not checked this place yet, so we're going to head here and check out the little Lethry Manor. Well, these are the guard quarters. I don't suppose that we will find them there. Maybe this is who we're looking for. And this better be important. Oh. Bedrooms. Bedrooms sounds good. I suppose you're looking for a tavern. I'm sure I can't help you. It's kind of weird when they're private bedrooms and they say, oh, you're, are you looking for a tavern by coming into our bedroom? Watch out, Nanda. Oh, this is where I came from. Private quarters. I just want to appeal to fairness. You've shown that you understand us, Nighty, and I will support this resolution. This means I now have three supporters. That's good. So we have convinced Athen Serefi to support House Telvani. And we have also convinced two more people. And for some reason, I did not. Ah, okay. I did not put the to-do list correctly. So we now have One, two. Okay, that's interesting. We, we, our our journal only speaks of two people, so maybe we should convince more. Which means we need more magic. Which means we need to sleep. We're not going to anger them by uh, sleeping in their bedroom, though. We're going to head to the Mage's Guild. Um, I thought this was the exit. Oh. This definitely is. Okay, so let's head back to the Mage's Guild through the rain. Have a quick nap and then with full magicka head back to convince one more councilman. Also we might be able to buy two soul gems with um, strong souls because we are stupidly rich and we are actually way too weak to capture the souls ourselves which means we should get stronger at some point where is the communal bedroom this is not it oh yeah okay this is i think where it is this is where it is and we slept for 10 hours to recharge our magicka. I just went into the wrong direction from the get-go. Let's head back upstairs and... Now we have a nice sunny day. Well, cloudy still, but... I think it's never actually sunny here. I don't, I don't know. I don't remember that it was. I mean, I could go back in the over 80 episodes and check, but too lazy. Okay. 
so let's check the area to the right. This is again the Moratong Guild Hall. You see, I can't remember anything, and this is Arabar Manor. And I think this was the one who we did what not. How does that be important? Okay, we don't need that book anymore. Just checked for blue, for blue text. Five quarters, and we basically just look for the owners of the house. To see. This better be important. I'm sorry, the um, drinking, drinking fizzy drinks makes me. Mm. Yeah. Makes me full of air. Uh, what now? Yeah, there we can appeal to fairness if we don't fail casting our persuasive spell. In the course of events, it is sometimes necessary to put aside the childish notions of allies and enemies and focus instead on a debate in which propositions are considered based only upon their merits. This indeed is one of those times that you have defended your position well, answering all of my concerns. I therefore shall support the revocation of the major skill monopoly, lest history look upon my actions with a baleful eye and claim that I allowed expediency to overwhelm principle. So we have three people. One, two, three. So we can go back to Master Aaron. Oh, in order to get out, I could also use the temple teleportation spell. If I don't feel casting it. We shouldn't have broken any of the major skills rules, by the way, um, because we're not allowed to steal or kill from other mages, so they should not cast us out, even though it was it is a very dick move, actually. But I always sided with a major skill in pre previous plays, and I kind of want to do something different, so I'm basically being stronger on the House Telvani now than on the major skill. I also sided strongly with the major skill, and then. Um, I was more a brawler type in this game. So this playthrough is completely different from, from what I'm used to in this game. And I have to say it is not as easy as if you just barge in with a weapon and kill them. I mean, I could play through the whole game just with the weapon that you find in the first cave, the Sparking Dagger. Come on, I haven't got all day, you know. Which is kind of weird. Ah, damn, I wanted to check for the soul gems with the enchanter. Well, next time. And here we are at uh, Master Ryan's chambers. I Let's see what he has to say about our accomplishments. First, have him leave the hallway, or else he will get stuck again. Master Ryan, I got three councilmen to uh, agree to work against the major skill monopoly. You have convinced at least three, at least three councillors. This deserves a reward. Perhaps you should use this glove. I enchanted it myself many years ago. So what about the monopoly now? You already convinced enough councillors on this issue. Soon we will take it before the Grand Council. 
Master Orion, can you tell me something about gathering strong souls? The souls of a summoned creature will work just as well. Just summon a storm matron, cast soul trap on it, and dispatch it. Do this twice while carrying a powerful soul gem and give the gems to Lunella Hilarion. Well, we can actually try that. Um, but I think... I don't know if you were equipped to fight a Storm Atronach. But we can also ask for more court chores. There is another Telvanni in trouble. I do not normally interfere with these manners, but I've taken an interest in this one. I need someone to stop the Red Orin attack on Favs, Anders and Shishi. Shishi, where is that? Several Red Orin have infiltrated Shishi, and the Tavani Faves Andes, uh, Faves Andes has gone into hiding. Shishi is a Velothi tower in the middle of the Foyada, the Foyada Banidat, northwest of Margan. Leave Margan, go east past the Siltstrider, then follow the Foyada north and west. If you cannot find Faves Andes, look for a skull on a desk, which opens a door to a secret storage place. Okay, I think we're actually going to do exactly that. So Master Orion says free shishi. And come on, there we go. Oh no 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 don't get stuck there. Oh, he's 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 continuing to walk. Let's let's just stand here. And, yes. Ah, uh, okay. Welcome. I feel as though I should know. Yeah. Eek. Please, by all means. Of course, we could also use slow fall here, but we don't have the spell. So we need to levitate down. Shishi is reachable from Margan, which is down here, I think. Yeah, that was exactly. I know that's more like Mar. Okay, Margan is then. Who are. Gnarmok. Laod. Let's first see where we need to go. Is that uh, that place? Yes, so it is Aldrun, and then either we can use the Silt Strider or something like that, or we just walk over through Balizra to Magan. Good. Also, I want to check uh, what kind of sun. Um, only a least Bonewalker and a Skeletal Minion, and I don't think that the Ancestor's Ghost... Oh, that's interesting. Command, Creature, and Humanoid, but yeah, that's not that... Not that interesting. There is... We do have three scrolls of summoning a Golden Saint for 60 seconds, which is something we could try. But I don't know if we fought a Golden Saint yet. I don't think so, and I guess they are too strong. On the other hand, you never know when you never try, right? So let's head somewhere where there is nobody. Maybe a rest, and then try to summon and soul trap a Golden Saint. And we can rest here, that's good. And rest until healed. Okay, so the Golden Saint won't do anything to us until we attack it because we summoned it, so I'm going to save. 
summon the golden. I guess a flame at your neck will also be a grand soul. And now let us see. Soul trap is also just 60 seconds. So this has worked. And now I'm just going to try out how we're going to kill them. Okay, so they need three hits to kill us. And they're not that good with... Or they're, they're very good with handling poison. Or they have a lot of... Um, a lot of hit points, which I guess is what's, what actually is the case. So I'm going to try doing it with a flame atronach instead. Um, soul trap, soul trap, soul trap. There, I was blind. Again, here we deal damage, but I don't know if we can do it in the 60 seconds. Yes, we have trapped a soul. Question is, is it big enough? Is we have a Bone Lord and a Flame Atronach here. So it could be that these are enough. We need to check by just going back, but we also need the construction contract. And I was thinking we're first going to go here, free that person, and then trying to get that contract. So we're going to free Shishi, and then I just noticed that I did not put in the order of, of events. So let's real quick do that. How's Telvani, my old stronghold, get construction contract there now, and the I don't know which entry I just changed, but it does not work. But we're just going to, and we're just going to do it like this. Go to Evan Hard, and there we go. So we're heading here. I think it was that way. Um, if I'm not totally confused. Off to Aldrun again. And here we are in Margan, and we're supposed to go northwest, which is this direction. So we can get to Shishi. I'm pretty sure we've already seen the place. Because the name is awfully familiar. But first we need to find the Foyada. I guess this will be easy. Three. Because it's kind of kind of canyon like thing. I guess it's this actually. So we're on the wrong side of the mountain. I might want to go back to Margan and go to head the other way. I think it's it's this here. Also, there are very disturbing noises, so another reason to head the other way. This better be important. So I'm just trying to. 
get out of Margan on the other side, but this is not the way to go. Hoping that I will enter this this foyada. There is a tower here. No exit, I guess. Wall, 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 tower, no exit. Okay. Hmm. As I said, I'm pretty sure we've already been there. Let me just search around for it. Okay, so this could be the Foyada World before, and this might actually be... This might actually be Shishi. If we're lucky, it already is. Because it looks like one of these tombs that you tell Bunny. And there we go, we have found Shishi. So basically the trick was to like, head a little bit off the road. And let us now rest first. There is already someone dead here. Who only has common clothing. Let us head deeper to the place. Okay, there are many dead people here. I guess these are the veteran attackers. Indrel, just common clothing. Amring. I mean, something or someone must have killed them. Okay, I'm allowed to sleep here. Is it? It's not safe enough though. And there is also just common stuff in here. You know what? Let us just. Fill the clothes sets here with the clothes, clothes from the corpses, just for fun. Just so when the guy gets here, he will have lots of weird clothing in his closet. So we're going to put these there. There we go. And now we can check the other side, the other wing. There is Marielle Amadi. It's just. I have you! Okay, very strong. Let's see poison damage. This this works better, but not not good. What damage do they do? Poison damage. Ah, they have um, they have spell reflection. Okay. So this means if I do this, then I will paralyze myself, I guess. Yes, I am willing to try out new stuff, so... I could try the fireball though, and I could also also use spell making to make a stronger. Let's try the fireball and then use spell making to make a stronger fire bite. Actually, Die, and the fireball means we don't need to. I mean, we can only cast it twice, and this was the wrong button. Yeah, this is not very good. And I think they also have a poison damage thing. It's not that um, they reflected it. Okay. Let's try to make our fire bite stronger and get a shield spell. Since we don't want to run back to Shishi all the time, you just mark this place. And now the sound is gone. 
I think my headphones just are out of battery. Great. Okay, so I resolved the sound issues. Um, basically, my upstairs PC connected to my Bluetooth headphones and took over the audio. Shut that one down and now it's working again. So let me, I did, already did the mark thing. Now we're going to do MC intervention to get out of here. And then we're just going to bring Gnesis. Okay, so let's try her to Aldrune to get a, that's here. Or we should have a Spellmaker actually here in the temple. Is it there? Uh, he sells spells. No, no, I'm just, I'm not going to go downstairs. I'm not going to search the whole temple because I do know there are spell makers in the Mages Guild. Whom we just basically betrayed, but they should not know that it was us. Plus, as I said, my allegiances lie with House Telvani. And the guy also is down here. Maybe he's trying to shield from the sun. It's still raining in Aldrin, which is weird. This is... Normally it's always just sandstorm. I mean, I'm not complaining, I'm just confused. I must be gone. So, Spellmaker, I have no clue where they are. Is Edwina the Spellmaker here? Let's check that out. No, she's just I must here. Say I find you most interesting right Are you the Spellmaker? No. I do enjoy a good conversation. No spell making service. Quickly, Outlander, or no spell making service. I mean, come I on, there should be enchanting. That's not where I want what to do go. You want of me, Outlander? I want to know where I can make spells. Is it the guild guide? Travel person? Are you a spell maker? No, I don't want to go to Balmora. There I know where the spell maker is. Is it one of the two in the entrance area, or doesn't Aldrun have a spellmaker? Which would be kind of weird, I think. 